sowing in the name Amen. of Jesus. Unbelievers, believe their priests. Believe me that I'm saying to you. Are you ready again? Yes. This month, nothing will make you cry in Amen. the name of Jesus Christ. May your promotion be more than your productivity. Amen. I'm not hearing you. May your enrichment be more than your investment. Amen. This month, take note of this gate of profit is wow. open for you in the name Amen. of Jesus. The gate of favor and help is open for you in the Amen. name of Jesus. This month, the gate of assistance is open for you in the Amen. name of Jesus. Pay right. attention to this one. This month, the trap of the enemy will not catch you. Amen. I'm not hearing you. I said the trap of the wicked will not catch you. Amen. God will open his good treasure upon your life this month in the name of Jesus. You will have peace like the river in the name of Jesus. I'm not hearing you. You will have peace like the river in the name of Jesus. You will have strength like the mountain in the name of Jesus. God will give you speed like eagle in the name of Jesus. And you will have wisdom like the ant in the name of Jesus. Pay attention. Famine and recession will not come to your address. I'm not hearing. I say famine and recession will not know your address. Amen. By the spirit of grace, this month you will gain new ground. Amen. By the spirit of grace, this month you will break fallow ground. Amen. By the spirit of grace, this month God will give you new ideas. Amen. By the spirit of grace, this month your enemies will make mistake. Amen. And I pray for you that your expectation shall turn to manifestation in the name of Jesus Christ. Every little, little things around you that can cause shame, the Lord will turn shame to testimony for you in the name of Jesus. Lord, today let your word come with power. Let the life and the story of somebody change. We give you praise. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Please, you may be seated. Praise God. It's wonderful. If people have appointments and they ring, won't they go? You didn't answer me. No matter how it rain, won't they go? You didn't answer me. Are you afraid? Nobody will beat you. If people have appointments, I should won't they go and it rain? Tomorrow morning, no matter how it rain, go to American Embassy. You will see people when they are talking like that. But once it's God, people don't respect. That is why I need to teach you on what I try to 
the children of darkness are wiser than children of light but that's not what i'm teaching you today this is a month of grace so i came to prophesy and i want you to take note of what i'm going to be prophesying upon your life i tell you this prophetic message your day of great favor is coming Amen. it's only 10 people i heard their voice i said your your day of great favor is coming Amen. i want you to note this that every day is made by god it's made by who god but a day of favor or a great day of favor is reserved for those that are preferred I repeat again every day is made by God do but the day of great favor is reserved for the people that are preferred now this is my prophecy upon your life God will prefer you this month to others in the name of Jesus there are some of you listening to me now you have heard prophecies you've had promises visions and revelations but instead for the word to come to pass you enter into another phase of life a phase of delay a phase of shame a phase of pain and embarrassment hacking to the voice of god in this month of grace god will replace uh, every shame and he will turn them to great grace for you in the name of jesus christ First Peter chapter 5 verse 10. First Peter chapter 5, chapter 5 verse 10. God of all grace. For the God of all grace who has in called this us month of grace who has called us. Unto his eternal glory by Christ Jesus. Unto his eternal glory by Christ Jesus. After that ye have suffered a while. Hey, after that you have suffered for some time. Make you perfect. God will make all things to be perfect for you. Yeah established god will establish you this month strengthen amen amen she one more by it will strengthen you this month and say to you and finally this month god will say to you if you believe that word without suffering without struggling it will locate you this month in the name of just you have suffered enough you have been marginalized you have been mocked you have been disgraced. You have been pushed aside. You are backstabbed. Because you are waiting for the manifestation of your word. You are waiting for the time your rema will come to pass. You are waiting for the time your logo will come to pass. The devil has blocked you. Which is hindered you. Power of darkness. They say you are not going. But thus say the Lord. Every area you have been mocked. God will give you double testimony in the name of Jesus Christ. Some of you, instead of testimony, what you see is shame. And you are saying, what is happening? I go to church. What have I done wrong? And some of you are asking, did God even speak to me at all? That dream, is it real? What happened to my prophecy? Your prophecy is real. The devil is the one that wants to frustrate you. In this month of great grace, what you couldn't get from January, Jehovah will surprise you this month in the name of Jesus some of you like Joseph you have been sold out get ready I want to begin to speak the word of God to your life some of you like Joseph you have been sold out friends that you trusted you gave your information to them they betray you pay attention to this one where you have been betrayed the Lord will give you what will make them celebrate your God in the name of Jesus Christ this amen is provoking me some of you like Joseph you are thrown into the pit as I'm talking now some of you are in pit of death some of you are in the pit of delay you are pit of shame somebody is talking to you anyhow because you are in the pit hacking to the voice of God to the world pit is a pit but to Christian pit is preacher in training your training is over in this month of grace in the name of Jesus and as your training is over your reign is starting in the name of Jesus Christ am I praying for people here? I say your training is over, your reign is starts in the name of Jesus Christ. I want to be sure you are the one I'm talking to. If you are the one, let me hear a thunderous amen now. And to some of you, you have been on the spot for a very long time. And because you have been on the spot for a very long time, miracle is becoming a mirage to you. You are saying, it's miracle real. For say the Lord, miracle will be real to you this month in the name of Jesus Christ. Why am I saying all this? From the throne of grace, God said, Tell my people in this month of grace, uh, there will be. He said, He said, Your day of great favor is approaching. He said, Your day of great favor is approaching. 
Say with me, say, my day of great favor. Say it's approaching. Say let me say my day of great favor is approaching. Now pay attention, say we miss it. I will not miss it. Shout a big amen. Genesis 41 from 39 to 46. Genesis chapter 41 from verse 39. My day of great favor. And Pharaoh said unto Joseph. And Pharaoh said unto Joseph. For as much as God had shown thee all this. For the Lord, as much as soon all this, there is none so discreet and wise as thou art. What will make the people in high places to bow to your God? God will show you this month. Amen. I will not beg you for him again. Don't worry. Oh, yeah, continue. Thou shalt be over my house. You shall be over houses. Amen. Amen. And according unto thy word shall all my people be ruled. Ah, where you have been mocked, where they have imprisoned you, you will rule over them. Amen. Only in the truth will I be greater than thou. Continue. And Pharaoh said to Joseph, Yes, continue. See, see, I have set thee over all the land of Egypt. Are you ready for this one? Where you never thought you can reign and have dominion, God will set you over those land in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. Yes, and Pharaoh took off his ring from his hand and put it upon Joseph's hand and arrayed him in vestures of Wait. fine linen. Wait. Ring means covenant. Now, I don't know who this one is for, but thus hear the Lord, the mighty will shit for you to see this month in the name of Jesus. Amen. Continue. And I read him in vestures of fine linen Continue. and put a gold chain upon his neck. Continue. And he made him to ride in his second, second chariot which he had. Yeah. And they cried before him, Bow the knee. Where they have said crucifying before, they will come back and say, decorating to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Continue. And, and he made him ruler over all the land of Egypt. Continue. 44. Verse 44. And Pharaoh said unto Joseph, Pharaoh said unto Joseph I am Pharaoh. He said, I am Pharaoh. And without thee shall no man lift up his hand of food in all the land of Egypt. Can I speak a word again? Yes, now without you in that profession, in that field uh, no man will make it until you come in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I continue. Let's continue. And Pharaoh called Joseph's name Safnat Pania. Yes, continue. And he gave him to wife Asnat, the daughter of Potiphar, priest of On. Yeah. And Joseph went over all the land of Egypt. Now Joseph was now walking like this, majestically everywhere. <laughs> Your walking will change. Amen. What can I mean? I said the way you walk, it will change. Amen. Yes, continue. Verse forty-six. Yes. Verse and 46. Joseph was thirty years old. Joseph was thirty. Years when old. he stood before Pharaoh, king of Egypt. Mm. And Joseph went out from the presence of Pharaoh and went throughout the land of Egypt. Thank you. Now, let me ask you a question before I say this seven prophetic words into your life. How many days does this one happen? How many days? Answer me. How many days? In one day. Now, likewise, if God can make it happen to Joseph, the Bible says Jesus Christ the same. Yesterday, today, and forever. Now, the same grace that worked for Joseph is coming upon somebody's here, somebody here in the name of Jesus Christ. Now let me begin to show you one by one what happened to Joseph. Please see it. First, his status changed from a prisoner to a prime minister. Excuse me, look at the gap from prisoner from one dirty end to a royal. Now, you might be at the very far side of life. You are thinking, when will it happen? Mm, I just came to prophesy. The Lord that made it happen for Joseph, he will make it happen for you in the name of Jesus. Yeah. I can see you believe with your amen. No, Allah. You are on the very far side of life. And you are thinking, oh, I beg, I beg. <laughs> the Lord that lifted Joseph from the dungeon will lift my son who lift my daughter here in the name of Jesus Christ. Look at me. When a man lifts you, let's say when a man lifts you, this is somebody now, he can only lift you to the height of his hand. 
But excuse me, Deji, when God lifts you, He carries you above the height of everybody. Now, is somebody ready? God will take you to the height that no man can take you in the name of Jesus Christ. Are you the one I'm praying for? The second thing that happened to him in one day, his clothes was changed from a prisoner's clothes to a royal wardrobe. Hmm. I don't know what you have been managing before. The garment you are wearing, maybe it's the garment of shame or delay. The Lord that changed the garment of Joseph in one day. That God will change your garment from garment of shame to garment of celebration. I don't know whether I'm in the right church today. I said the Lord will change your garment from that of debt to that to that of riches in the name of Jesus Christ. People will see you and they say, "Is he him? Is he not him?" By the reason of your garment that will change in the name of Jesus Christ. Number three, his mobility change from a trekker to a charioteer. From a trekker, he was trekking before. Now he's not just using any car; he was using the second best car in the land. Bible says, after you have suffered for a while, said to you, by the reason of the settlement that is coming this month, the car you never thought you can ride, the Lord will make the door for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Don't worry. I'm, I'm, I'm speaking to a few people. I said the things you never thought you can do and achieve, uh, the Lord will open the door for you this month in the name of Jesus Christ. Number four is accommodation change. Some of you, you like to take photo in somebody else's house. You pay for that house. But by the reason of what God will do, I prophesy upon your life that your accommodation will change in the name of Jesus Christ. There is a level you get to, you know you are more than where you are living. I just want to live. I want to I want to, I want to get out of this side. Where befit the place that befits your personality. The Lord will take you there in the name of Jesus Christ. I, I did the one I'm praying for. I said, We are the place that befits your, your personality, the place that fits your person. The Lord will take you there in the name of Jesus Christ. If you are the one I'm praying for, let me hear dangerous amen first. Now. The Bible says it's marital status change. Huh? Excuse me, when will a slave be able to marry a king's daughter? Or now he's able to marry, it will be difficult. But God made it happen. Now what you cannot do by a job, I want to pray for you. What you cannot do by savings, huh? what you cannot do by 100,000 every year, every year, every year, every year, the Lord will make it happen for you from me in the name of Jesus Christ. You didn't hear me. I said, what you cannot do by contribution, contribution, loan job, what you cannot do by salary, what you cannot do by contract, what you cannot do by meeting people, the Lord will make it happen for you in the name of Jesus Christ. I, I want to be sure I'm talking to my son and daughter here. What you have not labored for, where you have suffered, uh, the Lord will make you to enjoy good in the name of Jesus Christ. If you are the one I'm talking to, let me hear dangerous amen now. The Bible says, uh, one day, hardship, pain, delay, everything end. Uh, I prophesy in this month of grace uh, that every hardship in your life end in the name of Jesus Christ. You are getting comforted. You are receiving honor. You are receiving dignity. You are being celebrated. And finally, the Bible says, the economy of the nation was put in his hand. Let me see your hand. Uh, let me see your hand. Uh, when they put the economy of local government in your hand, do you know what it is, sir? I pray for you. I prophesy upon your life. Uh, the finances that is much more than your village can handle, God will put in your hand in the name of you. The finances, excuse me, the person that has financial power has a control. God will give you financial power in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh my God, oh my God. I said, God will give you financial power in the name of Jesus. If you are the one I'm praying for, shout three amen. Let me hear you now. When they put the whole finance in his hand, what does he want to do that cannot do? Every project you have been struggling with, every project you want to do, everything your spirit wants to do, 
but money constrain you i prophesy to your life uh, god will give you financial power i'm not hearing you i say god will give you financial power that project god will pay for it in the name of jesus i said that project god will finance it in the name of jesus if you are the one that pray for shout amen oh sit down joseph's favor was not ordinary yes or no it was not a regular favor god will give you a favor that is not regular it was a great favor that happened in one day that's why i said you two get ready your day of great favor has started i'm not hearing you get ready great favor is coming your way say let me hear you say my day of great favor has come tell the person beside you for me tell him my day of the great favor has come now i've seen people enjoy favor one favor in one day one favor in one day but it's rare before you find several favors an avalanche of favor in one day i pray for you get ready for an avalanche of favor in the name of jesus Christ. i've seen people in one day they got one testimony get ready for an avalanche of testimonies in the name of jesus Christ. oh my god from this month money we meet money in your hand you can hear from this month miracle will meet miracle in your hand i'm not hearing you connection we meet connection in your hand before you exhaust this one another one will have come in the name of jesus every form of recession and famine of great things it will not be your portion in the name of jesus Christ. somebody shout grace shout it again and sit down grace listen to me god can do anything god owns the yam and the knife you understand now? god owns what when when god gives you the yam and the knife what's your compl- problem again you have everything he owns the yam and the knife matthew 19 26 my day of great favor my day of great favor as one is coming another one is coming as one is coming, another one is coming. Then people will ask you, are you the only one that is there to you? She won the corner. Then you begin to say, it's not me, it's not my fault. It's just my turn and my time. How many of you believe that it can be your turn and your time even from this month? Amen. Did you say man? I said it can be, it will be your turn and your time in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let me read Matthew. Matthew chapter 19 verse 26. Yes. But Jesus beheld them. Jesus, look at them. And said unto them. And said unto them. With men this is impossible. Now you are thinking that how can this be? Listen to Jesus. He said with men this is impossible. But with God all things are possible. If you believe it is possible, shout a big hallelujah. <laughs> now I, I see something in verse 44 that I want to use to pray for you. He said, verse 44 said, look. He said, Joseph, I am Pharaoh. And I call the shot here. This month of grace, I don't know which size will I face. I don't know where the person is. Are you sure? This month of grace, God will make you to meet the people that matter. Excuse me, sir. The people that call the shot, God will make you meet them in the name of Jesus Christ. The people that immediately you answer their question, they will answer your financial question. God will make you be them in the name of Jesus Christ. This month, this month. Uh, now listen, Joseph did not look for Pharaoh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you are looking for great people, you might not see them. Yes, but if they want to see you, yes, are you ready for this one? God that made Pharaoh to look for Joseph, are you ready for this one? He will make them to look for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Oh my! I say God will make the people that matter to look for you in the name of Jesus Christ. And let me see your hand. Let me see your hand. And after you have met them, you will not return empty-handed. You are looking for my trouble, oh. You know how many people you have met? How did you come? I said this time around, you will not return empty-handed in the name of Jesus Christ. If you are the one I'm talking to, shout grace, 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 grace. grace. 
sit down. There are people that are in charge of affairs. God will make you to meet them. Every storyteller you have been meeting, there are some useless meeting. You do the meeting, do the meeting, do the meeting. What is the result? Let me pray. Are you ready for this one? This month, useless meeting stop in the name of Jesus Christ. From useless meeting, you are moving to fruitful meetings in the name of Jesus Christ. If you are the one I just pray for, let me hear dangerous amen now. Psalm 1 35 verse 6. Psalms 135 verse 6. Whatsoever the Lord pleased, may it please the Lord this month to that make a way for you. Amen. May, may it please God, your maker, this month to make a way for you. Amen. Let's continue. Whatsoever the Lord pleased, that yeah. did he in heaven. Anything God wants to do, he could do out. In earth, on earth. And, and in the sea and all the places. I pray for you again. This is only for five, five people. May he please God this month to help you specially. Yeah. Psalm 46 verse 10. Yes. Be still. Oh God, look at me, everybody. This month, be still. And know that I am God. And know that God is not governor, it's not government, it's not president, he's the one that created everything. Be I, still and know this month. The Bible says, Those that know their God shall be what? Strong, strong and, and do exploit. exploit. You will do exploit this month in the name of Amen. Jesus Christ. I will be exalted among the heathen. Hey, God will exalt his name in your life among unbelievers this month in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Oh, my pray, pray of him from the Bible. I say, God will exalt his name in your life, even among unbelievers in the name of Jesus. Amen. Continue. I will I will be exalted in the heart. In your location where you are living, people will know you are serving a true God. Move to Romans chapter 9, verse 15 for me. I, I'm, I'm showing you what will happen for you this month. It's now left for you to believe. Romans chapter 9, verse 15. I believe. Yes, Lord. I believe. Yes, Lord. It is well with me. It is well. Say with me. Say, Lord, this month, no useless meeting. Lord, this month, no useless meeting. You are not saying it very well. Don't provoke me. Say, let me hear loud and clear. Say, let me hear you. Lord, this month, no useless meeting. Somebody say, Lord, I am entering fruitful meetings this month. Lord, I am meetings this month. Say, say result-oriented meetings. Result meetings. Say in the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. Oh, yeah, say amen. amen. Read for me. Romans 9, verse 15. This particular passage caused trouble in a conference that I attended some years back because of this particular statement. Read, let them hear. For he said to Moses, God said to Moses, I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy. He said, anybody that I want to have mercy on, I have mercy on them. And I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. Do you know what I mean? That means some people are not going to have mercy on them and not going have compassion on them. Wait till they do God. Wait till they do God. Pastor, let me the apostle, wait till they do God. So, Pastor Verso, as if they have not seen it before, he said, we want you to tell us, where did these people do God? I said, maybe you are one of the people where God no go have mercy on. That's why you are shouting like this. This month, among the people that God will have compassion on, may you be among them in the name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. You are not saying amen very well. I said, among the people that God will have mercy on, among the single sisters, uh, among pastors, uh, among entrepreneurs, uh, among workers, uh, among Christians, uh, that God will have mercy on me. Your name be there in the name of Jesus Christ. This month, you will see mercy. This month, grace will speak for you. I have prayed for you. This month, you are blessed specially. Anybody that cursed you, they are cursed this month. Too. Anybody that bless you, they are blessed this month. Too. In the name of Jesus Christ. This two prayer is a twin prayer. This month, you will no longer be delayed. The twin brother of that prayer is that you shall be called upon in a hurry. You didn't hear me? I said, you shall be called upon in a hurry. I said, I said, you shall be called upon in a hurry. If you are the one I'm praying for, shout a dangerous amen now. 
there are some things that the mighty needs that is in your hand. Some of you, your brain is generator of money, but you can't get the money. Ah, let me pray for you. Everything the mighty needs, as they meet you and they deliver, they will say to you. This month, you will no longer hear story. You will see results. Only pray and pray, pray for you. Do you believe? Do you, you, do you believe? If you believe, oh yeah, take it times two in the name of Jesus Christ. Open the Bible for me. Hebrews chapter 11 verse 6. Hebrews chapter 11 verse 6. But without faith, it is impossible to please A. Oh God, do you have faith for this month? Yes, sir. Oh God, do you have faith for this month? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes continue. For he that cometh to God that must to believe God. that he is. Must believe that God is. And that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Because in. God is a rewarder. He said, I will put a difference between that serving me and that not serving me. This month, your reward starts in the name of Jesus. Take your pen. What do I do? What do I do? I need to tell you what do I do. You need to know what do I do. What do I do? We are still going to pray. I have finished. When I finish prophesying, now you will pray and we'll take communion. We'll take communion to seal it. Anybody that fight against your grace this month will see disgrace. As I'm talking, the heavenly host, back it up, that you have suffered enough, get ready to testify in the name of Jesus. Well. You must know, if this thing must happen, that our God is a God of great possibilities. I've taught you that before. And you must believe in him. Please, look at me. Remove your focus from man that he eh, didn't help me. I see here people saying, he didn't help me. Chapter 1, verse 1, did you see that he must help you? We have people refuse to help you. Can I pray for you? This month, God will help you. Yeah. How do I know? I will lift up my eyes onto the hills. From where is coming my help? Help me now, help me, help me. My help coming from God. That made heaven, heaven and we are... If God can make heaven and earth, can't he help you? The people you are pursuing, they did not make earth. They are chopping from earth. Shall I continue? If you want me to continue, shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Now I noticed something about Joseph. Among his father's children, the Bible said Joseph and others. Yes. Yes, that's what the Bible said. But Joseph, he obeyed God in small and big things. Joseph had opportunity to sin. He didn't sin. Oh God, look at me. You've got to obey God if all this word will come to pass in your life. See, I hear you. You've got to obey who? Bible says, if you are willing and obedient, you will eat the best of the land. So you see. You've got to obey God. Not your brain. Not situation. Stop saying, I ain't share People, they do am. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Number three, you've got to please God. Please Him. After all, you are created for His pleasure. Please Him. You've got to please your Maker. Stop pleasing men. What will people say? What will people say? Bullshit. What will my Maker think? What will my Maker say? What will my Maker do to me if I do this and I provoke God? Should I continue? Joseph's faith was full. Even when he was suffering, he was in the prison for 13 years. Still, he did not wait. Let your faith, check your faith meter. Do, is your faith full? Can you trek to church and trek back and believe that my God can do exceedingly, abundantly, above and beyond? We are in the rare era of bread and butter Christian. Everybody wants it like microwave. You want miracle now, but terms and condition. Joseph did not compromise. Look at me. Don't compromise. A Coke bottle, Coca-Cola bottle, when it gets to Cameroon or Canada, it does not change to bitter lemon. Don't compromise because nobody is there. 
Nobody was with Joseph, but he did not come right. Luke was what all he did before he got the miracle. Can I pray for you? You will get your own miracle too. Yeah. I'm not hearing. I said you will get your own miracle too. Yeah. Next one, let your heart be merry. Some of you, because you pay salary, immediately you pay salary to your worker. You begin to, you begin to call a more. I don't, I, I don't know English, Timobello. You begin to get frustrated. You begin to say something. You people are very stupid. I don't see what you are doing. You are just collecting my money. You. I see people like that. You pay just three staff. You people are useless. I need a change of life. Hey. Every month then when Pastor Paul pays, when they pay Hebrews, they pay um, sanctuary, my the people I pay is more than both. And he asked, How are you doing it? I say is your money missing? Let me pray for you. Let me see your hand. You will do great things with ease this month. God knows your capacity. He knows you have good heart. God will give you what it takes to take care of people in the name of Jesus Christ. Stop blaming yourself. Stop blaming people. And it's mounting. I shouldn't have done this. No. Don't regret. Don't regret. Don't blame yourself. Stop blaming people. God is about to do great things. Did you be, do you believe? If you believe, let me hear I believe. The Bible says rejoice evermore. Is that not what the Bible says? And I saw one day the Bible said, The joy of the Lord is my strength. That my daughter asked me when they said, Daddy, you're always happy. Why? Never. Never. I have never sat down. I'm telling you. Oh, Pastor B. I don't get wine for house. There is no, I'm telling you, I enjoy like president in my house. I don't have, there is no dull moment. No dull moment. I have wine section. I don't have bitter, I don't have a lot more session. I'm telling you. Enjoy your life. Say, I hear you. Something good is coming. Enjoy your life. Enjoy your life. Have you noticed birds? Birds. Hey, yeah. Yoruba says, Enjoy your life. You want to eat? Give me two momo. There's fish. There's bakoto. The condition I am now. Why do you want to eat? I don't want to eat well. Enjoy, tell the person, tell him, enjoy your life. Tell him, enjoy your life. Tell him, your great, your day of great fever is coming. Enjoy your life. I cannot come and kill myself. I will chop the life of my head. I will chop the life. I don't know the end of tomorrow. I'm telling you, chop the life of your head because you don't know tomorrow. And this morning, you'll be doing like cat everywhere. It's not fair. I hate such people around me. Then you will not talk, you'll be looking. They say, How are you? Stop it. God is not a man that should lie. In fact, the way you are doing is making God to be angry. Stop it. God is coming for you. I read in the Bible, a madman of gathering, and Jesus went for this man. Ah, your maker has not forgotten you, my dear. A donkey tied in the village. Jesus, he said, go to the village. Go bring my donkey, come. Ah, God will locate you where you are in the name of Jesus Christ. I wonder what the donkey was thinking. They tied him there. Only him. Every other donkey, they are free. He must be thinking, what do I do? What do I do? It's because of prophecy. Don't make it bad by the way you are reacting. Rejoice in the Lord. Bible says, rejoice evermore. Evermore means rejoice. Continue rejoice until your time comes. And your day of favor has started in the name of Jesus Christ. 
Let me add three more before we pray. Don't forget to read your Bible. Why should I read my Bible? You remember Joshua 1 8? He said, This book of the Lord will not depart from your mouth, and from it shall you meditate day and night. And from it shall you make your way prosperous. And I've taught several times that most times principle works more than prayer. And that's why you see people, they go to church, they fast, they do revival, they do everything, but they don't follow principle. And the people that go to principle churches, they are prospering. This month, you will prosper. Amen. Principle, read your Bible, this book of the Lord. After you finish reading the Bible, oh yeah, pray. And when you are praying, I've told you, stop complaining to God. I don't have a baby, I don't have a house, and you are God, you are God, Abby. Don't stop it. Just worship him and thank him and remind him of his word. And leave the rest to him. He will surprise you this month. I like to add this. Anytime you have opportunity to give, give your best. I repeat, anytime you have opportunity to give, do what? Give your best. Why? Because you are preparing for your day of great favor. No, they give God loose change. I have told you. Stop giving God money as if he's begging from your father. Give him wholeheartedly. I believe with this free point of mind, I've been able to convince you that something big is coming for you. Now look at me. You might not look, you might not look like, it, like it, but nobody has the right to judge you because they are not your maker. By the time the thing will come, they will know you look more like it and more than it in the name of Jesus. Rise on your feet and let us pray. Lift up your hand everywhere you are and say, Lord, I believe your word. Say to him again, Lord, I believe your word. Say it again, Lord, I receive your word. Say into my heart, I believe my day of great favor is coming fast. Say, my father, my king, as I believe and stand on your word, Surprise me by fire. Surprise me by fire. Say in the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. Say big amen. amen. But you see, wherever you are, if you have not given your life to Jesus Christ, it's a taboo. We are in a, um, um, a season now that being born again is no longer in vogue. Ah, it might not be in vogue, but without you giving your life to Jesus Christ, you are finished. So anywhere you are, you want to do this with me. You want your day of great favor to come? You've got to give your life to Jesus. Say, Pastor, I want to do that. Anywhere you are, whether you are here or you are watching from anywhere, say this prayer with me. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I am sorry. I am sorry. I confess my sins. I confess my sins. And I forsake them. And I forsake them. Jesus, come into my heart. Jesus, come into my heart. Be the Lord and master over my life. Be the Lord and master over As my life. As from now on. As from now on. I reject Satan and his work. Say thank you, Lord, for saving me. Thank you, Lord, for saving me. In Jesus' mighty name, we we'll pray. Amen. Lord, I pray for the people that said the prayer with me that you will hold them, wash them, decorate them. Amen. Write their names in the book of life. Amen. And together, myself, these ones, and them, we shall make it to heaven. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, we we'll pray. Amen. Say amen. Amen. I'm not hearing you. Somebody say a big amen. Amen. I want you to pray like this. Before Joseph got to the palace, God created a need. Are you, are you listening to me now? I want you to pray. Say after me. Say, Lord. Lord create a great need. Create a great need. In great places. In great places. Where I will be needed. Where I will be needed. Oh, shame, shame, shame. Pray. Say after me. Say, Lord. Lord. Before, before David was called from the bush, there was a need. Excuse me. Great people don't want you when they don't have problem or when they don't have a need. There must be a need. Are you, are you hearing me now? There must be a what? A need. Are you hearing us say with me? Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Create a great need. Create a great need. In great places. In great places. For me. For me. We are will be needed. We are will be Open needed. your mouth and let us pray Lord together, Lord everybody. Mother, everybody, everybody, are you praying? For me. We are will be needed in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father. Create a great need, oh God. Lord, we are will be needed. In a great places, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Say after me, say, My Father, my Father, campaign for me, campaign for me. Oh 
God. Say it again. Say my father. My father. Say my father. My father. Can pay for me. Can pay for me. Before rulers and leaders. Before rulers and Open leaders. Open your mouth and pray oh in the name Lord, of Jesus. Lord, my father. Lord, can pay, can pay, can pay for can me. Can pay. Lord, before rulers and leaders. You are not praying. In the name of Jesus. Lord, can pay for me before Holy rulers and God. leaders. In the name of Jesus. Lord, can pay for me king. before leaders and rulers. In the name of Jesus. Excellent. Lord, God. can pay for me before rulers and leaders. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, can pay for Glorious me. Glorious God. Rulers and can leaders. pay for me. In the name of Beautiful Jesus. Beautiful Lord, king. can pay for me, Lord. Oh Lord, can pay for me. Before rulers and leaders, in the name of Jesus. Lord, can pay for me. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Say, Lord, Lord, plant your magnet of favor into my life. Plant your magnet of favor into my life. When God plants His magnet over your life, even now, wizards see you, they say, "I just like this guy." Plant your magnet of favor into my life. Are you ready to pray? Yes, sir. Are you ready to pray? Open your mouth and pray Lord, in the name of Jesus. My Father, Lord, plant, plant your magnet of favor, into, of my favor life. into my life. Oh Lord, plant, oh Lord. plant, plant your, your magnet, magnet of, favor. of favor into my life. Plant your magnet of favor into my business. Plant your magnet of favor into my career. In the name of Jesus. Are you praying? Oh Lord, plant your magnet of favor into my life. Plant your magnet of favor into my business. In the name of Jesus. Plant the magnet of favor into my life. In the mighty name we pray. Amen. When something is leaking, it cannot gather things. Say, I reject favor leakage. I reject favor leakage. One. Number two, I reject favor anemia. I reject favor anemia. You know what I mean? They say somebody has anemia. You know what I mean of anemia? What do you mean of anemia? That means blood in no rich. So, I reject favor when no rich. I reject favor when no rich. I reject favor when no gauge. I reject favor. Do you understand now? I've heard your body say, Oh, no, I said, Dear, no, say, you hear what the body said. I hate that prayer. Don't say it to me. Come on, my dear. Let God do everything. God will not do part of your problem, He will do everything. Say, I reject favor leakage. Say it now. I reject favor leakage. Say, I reject favor and I reject favor and Say, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and cry to God like that. Jesus, I reject favor leakage. I reject favor and in the name of Jesus. I reject oh God, yes, of God, shortage of favor in the name of Jesus. I reject favor and in the name of Jesus. I reject favor leakage, Lord. I reject favor and in the name of Jesus. I reject shortage of favor in the name of Jesus. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. I reject favor. I reject favor shortage in the name of Jesus. I reject favor leakage. I reject favor shortage in my life. You are. Jesus is the Lord. Jesus is the Lord. Jesus is the Lord. Jesus is the Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I'm not hearing you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. We reject favor leakage. I reject favor leakage. <laughs> praise God. I'm not here. I say praise God. Put your hand on your nave. Say my father. my father. Trust me on this prayer. Just follow me. Say my father. My father. Create a soul tie. Create a soul tie. Between myself and my angel of favor. Between myself and my angel of favor. You understand what I mean by that? Yes, sir. When there is a soul tie between you and your angel, before anything touch you, mm, he protects you. He goes to places and do for you when there is a soul tie. When there's a soul tie between you and somebody, you can't sleep. You say, me, me, you live. Why? Because there is a soul tie. If the person died, there's a soul tie. So I want to use so tight in a good way now. Put your hand on your navel. Don't worry. Trust me. Trust me. It was standing as clean so time for me. Oh, it's so tight of good. Amen. Eh? That 
that wherever place they have tied you, that angel will go and lose you today. Amen. Put your hand and say, My father. My father. Create a soul tie between myself and my angel. Create a soul tie between myself and my angel. Open your mouth and let us pray like oh, that. Lord, my father. Create a soul tie between I pray. myself and my angel. In the name I of Jesus. Pray. My father. Create a soul tie between me and my angel. In the name of Jesus. My father. Create a soul tie between me and my angel. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' of Jesus. name we pray. Follow me, say my favor from the north. My favor from the north. Locate me. Locate me. My favor from the east. My favor from the east. Locate me. Locate me. My favor from the south. My favor from the south. Locate me. Locate me. My favor from the west. My favor from the west. Locate me. Locate me. Can we pray together, everybody now? In the name of Jesus. My favor from the north. Locate me. My favor from the east. Locate me. My favor from the west. Are they locate praying? me. My favor from the south. My locate favor, look at me. In the name of Jesus. My favor from the north. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I'm not hearing. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I pray for you this month that you will not go out and come back empty anymore in the name of Jesus amen. Christ. Amen. Is that the best amen you can say? This month, God will deliver you from useless meeting that have no result in the name of Jesus Christ. The yeah. amen is not encouraging me. This month, God will deliver you from stupid traveling that had no reward in the name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. I told you of somebody that went abroad after seven years, he came back with toy gun. What did you mean? Is it like toy gun that bring water? Ah. This month, God will give to you what you cannot get in six months in the name of Jesus Christ. Now look at me. All hanging promises, God will combine them together and make them to be a testimony this month in the name of Jesus Christ. I want you to pray. Lord, I thank you for settling me this month. Lord, I thank you. Open your mouth and thank you very quickly. Lord, I thank you for settling me this month. Thank you for settling me in all areas this month, Lord. Lord, I thank you for settling me in all areas this month in the name of Jesus. Thank you for settling me, Lord. Lord, this month of May, thank you for settling me, Lord. Lord, I give you glory, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Stretch your hand to this communion as we take it. One of the things I want you to pray for is spiritual gift. What do I say you should pray for? And one of the ones I want you to have is discernment. When you can discern, when somebody is lying to you, you know. When you can discern, a man that can discern is greater than a man that can prophesy. You can prophesy if they block him, but if you can discern, you know the truth. You know, you know where you are going to. When you can discern, when you are even going on the wrong road, you know this is the wrong road. So I want you to, I want you to, to pray, Lord, as I take your flesh and your blood today, give me discernment. Give me discernment. Please pray. Give me discernment. And after you have prayed about discernment, you will pray, heal my body. Heal my bones. Heal my blood. Heal my body. Heal my bones. Heal my blood. Partake of your blood. Give me discernment in the name of Jesus. Give me the spirit of discernment, Lord. Lord, heal my bones. Heal my body. In my soul, in the name of Jesus, I shall partake of your flesh and your blood. Lord, give me the spirit of discernment in the name of Jesus. He, my body, pray that anything God has not planted in your life, that God should uproot them as you take this. Anything God has not planted in your body, in your bones and blood. Everything God has not planted in my life, let them be uprooted by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Lord, as a partake of your body and your blood. Give me the spirit of discernment, Lord. Lord, in my bones. And pray again body, that at the end soul, of the day we shall reign together with him. Me. Oh God, let them be. I will not be missing in heaven. You will not be missing in heaven. I will not be missing in heaven in the name of Jesus. At the end of the day, I will not miss heaven. 
in the name of Jesus. At the end of the day, the I will blood not be missing. of Jesus in set the name of me Jesus. free. Let your blood set me free. This From morning. sin and sorrow. Let your blood set the me blood free. Of in the name Jesus. of Jesus. Let your blood set me free. Let your blood set me free. The blood of Jesus. Let your blood set me free. The blood of Jesus set me free. From sin and sorrow, the blood of Jesus set me free. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Our Father, we thank you. Thank you all. We bless you for another opportunity to take. I take of your blood and your body. Father, Lord, the Bible says, "Some do this unto death." And sickness, but Lord, this one we will take this, we shall live in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Any deadness in anybody here in the womb, in the body, in the bones, fibroid, glaucoma, stroke, as you taste this blood today, let them disappear in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I pray, Lord, for special discernment for my people. That you will grant them spiritual or in hope. Tried and true with hands given. I'll be a living sanctuary for you. Lord, prepare me. Lord, prepare me. Oh, you're at home. You're at home. 